in the previous tutorial we looked at the substring function and in this tutorial we'll be looking at the slice function in JavaScript so the substring is can be used for only strings and nothing else so if let's say we have this particular string over here and we want to substring uh, the first two characters you can simply say sub just provide two arguments it should start from zero and end at the second character then we get the two characters inside the string similarly we can do that with same with the slice function so when we do 0 comma 2 we get the same thing but the interesting thing about the slice function is it can be used for both strings and arrays so for example we have another array which is an array of numbers from zero sorry from one to ten so we can slice from the first to the second index so we get the first two items so if we do slice two when you provide just one argument it will start from the index that you have provided inside the argument as a number and then show the rest so we can try out substring over here to see how it behaves so let's provide to you realize substring is not a function so meaning substrings can only be used for strings and not arrays so if you let's say you uh, you have an array and then you have a string you can either choose to go with slice to help you manipulate the array to your taste so I can also do let's say another array uh, minus three sorry that's length over here I want to get the last three items inside the array and there we have it so thanks for watching this tutorial don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more see you next time